Hey, hello. Welcome to my channel. This is Let's Go Marty, and today we're playing Splatoon 2. This past October, I picked up a Nintendo Switch for the very first time, and one of the games I had to get with it was, you know, Splatoon 2, the game you're seeing right now. This game is the perfect game for me right now where I'm at, because if you don't know, I used to play a lot of Valorant, and when I played a lot of Valorant, the game was super toxic, and it, it wasn't even fun to play at sometimes. I just played it because apparently I was good at it. But coming over to Splatoon 2, it's just been really fun. So I'm bringing you some Splatoon 2 gameplay right here. So I'm so my current setup is I'm using a paint roller, I think, if I'm not mistaken. No, I'm sorry, that's not paint roller. This is a paint brush, okay? Um, I don't know too much about builds. I'm new to this game. I'm trying to earn my stripes so I can play in ranked. And I can be ready to go at the game heavily when Splatoon 3 drops. You see me going around doing my thing right here. It's currently pink versus purple, and I'm at the top of leaderboards as, you know, obviously. This this game is very easy, especially in the low-ranked casual matches that I get put in. Um, one thing I can say though is, oh see, I just got splattered right there by end zone with the paint roller. That's kind of hard to avoid, at least right now. But, as I was saying, it's extremely hard for me, really hard for me to avoid, I'm sorry, to, to aim properly when I'm using the controller. So I'm gonna try the analog stick. I just I just keep reading everywhere that the analog stick isn't really the best to use, but I struggle. And I traded with Gabe right there. That should have been a clean kill for me, honestly. These lower ranks, man. It's like everybody's using a paint roller. Which I mean, it's not bad. It's just frustrating to play against if you use anything else. I can't really use like the rifles because, as I said before, that I suck with the motion aiming. So I gotta, I gotta give it, um, hold on, this guy's about to splat me. One minute left, we, we gotta, we gotta tighten up. There we go, one pick right there. Move on for a second. Ah, uh, I get splatted by Amy. Amy's been pressing me this whole game, she's the only one stopping me. The map is not looking too even right now, it looks like we're down, but I'm sure we can come up. We aren't looking too hot over here, man. I'm gonna try to spawn on Jensen and see what I can do over there when I land. I don't have my splat down or anything. Oh, but I'm gonna try to catch this guy lacking. See, that's what I mean about these pin- oh, I got him. That's what I mean about these pin rolls. It just covers so much area, and it does, like, a lot of damage. Because at these lower ranks, it's not like you're fighting from a distance, really. And I don't know, I can't speak for the higher ranks. But at the lower ranks, you're right there in each other's faces. Because for the most part, half the people down here can't even aim with the motion controls. That's also a complaint that I have. But, like I was saying about the rollers, it's just overpowering. Because when you are in somebody's face, it's a one-shot. And then it just covers so much area. It looks like my efforts here in the middle paid off as we are in the final few seconds of the match. Three, two, one. Let's check out this map. That's clear as day to see the was. It's not clear as day, but it's pretty fair to say that I am the winner here. Yep, and I'm right. 52.8 to 39.6. I always at the top of the leaderboards. Oh wait. <laughs> it's obviously Marty. Come on, I do this with six with six splats in three splat downs. I really do this. I'm going to cut to the next match in three, two, and we are back for match two on Black Belly Skate Park here. I'm your host, Let's Go Marty, and we're here with the player Marty, playing for the yellow team, going up against the pink team. Let's you walk away with this victory. I think this victory is very crucial for Marty right now. He needs to win this game so he can rank on up in the leaderboards. He's currently moving around with the paintbrush, you know what I'm saying, splatting all the platforms, trying to get a good little area so for, for him and the scene. He's doing pretty good right now, I like to say. Now in this game, Marty will have some tough competition, he's going up against the Amy, and for those of you who don't know, Amy has been pressing Marty since he joined this Platoon 2 lobby, but he continues to paint there with a little splat down to secure more of the area. Now, a lot of people may be saying to themselves, oh, Marty, he's playing, he's playing too slow, he, he's not being aggressive, he's not pushing the attackers, but you guys have to understand, the name of the game in Splatoon 2 is the arena that you paint, okay? You have to paint majority of the arena to win the game, that's, that, that's just common knowledge here. Hold on, Marty's getting pushed right here. The spot down with a spot down to kill. Spot down gets to kill on um, Miana, or however you say her name, but she's not a part because she's obviously a psycho. I think it's a double spot down on Fabian. Oh man, but he gets spot in the process. But like I was saying, you can't win that Splatoon 2 if you don't ink half the area. And as you can see from the map, it's, it, it's looking about 50 50. It's kind of even right now. So I think Marty's playing fair in his game. He's up against the aim right there. Back this up into a corner. How will Marty play the situation? Will Marty be able to get the spot down? It's a tough fight. He loses. 
not to Amy, but Fabian. And you really can't tell with these options. They all look the same to me if I'm keeping it a buck 50 with you. Even though Marty just lost that gun battle to Fabian, he's still looking very cool and collected and drew the spot on his teammate in the middle of the paint. But once this, he gets marked by Amy, his true rival once again in this Amy has just been dogging this man left and right. She, she's painting majority of the field. She's carrying her team. But Marty is eagerly able to get back into the paint. And he's ready to pursue Amy on top of this pillar right here. Will he be able to give it to her in time? She's trying to block him out with the pink paint. But Marty keeps on pushing. And Marty gets a spot on with Amy. Amy is not looking too hot right now. But Marty's up and winning right now as usual. Once again, Marty is coming through providing value to the team members right here. Just camping in the middle, just looking out here, trying to get a snipe with the grenade. Will you be able to find it? He won't be able to find it, but one as you come down on the final minute, Marty's trying to make an eager push to get rid of this pink paint as much as possible. He's trying to get rid of all the tiny bits, all the big bits, anything that can help us get ahead. He has a spot now, but I don't he's saving it for. But he's, oh, he's going to get killed? Oh, he misses the spot down. That is extremely unfortunate for Marty. And he only gets a spot down with Marty. See what I'm saying? Amy has just been pressing Marty since the day he joined this lobby, but it's not looking bad for them. They're, they're controlling majority for the They're looking about 75 to 25 percent right now. I can't really tell us what's going on. You know what I'm saying it's more like 60 30, but who cares, right? Marty's back in the paint again, and he's he's going, he's keep going, he's eager. Nothing can stop him right now. Marty's Marty's 50 or 50 from the field. Well, 50 or 50, but it's probably up there. And he has his teammate Jonna spawning on him. Marty's looking very confident. Oh, man, he gets spotted. He's not looking too hot right now. I'm keeping it real with you, but he's still trying to do his little thing. They're, Pink is storming through Marty's half. Will they be able to hold off until we get through? That's game. That's game, set, match, point. That was a very close fight. Who would come up with the victory here? I can't even tell you, honestly. Let's see. And it's 47.6 to 41.1. That was an insanely tough fight. I know Marty was sweating at the end of that. Marty comes over the top of the leaderboard with four splats and three splats down. No one is stopping him. Now let's go ahead and cover to the third game. Yo, <laughs> I just want to say um, I was having way too much fun with that voiceover. I feel like I was a sports commentator, but I'm going to try to keep it more in the moment. So we're back again with the third game. It's green versus purple again on Black Belly Skate Park. Marty's back at it again. I'm sorry, not Marty. I'm back at it again. I'm trying, I'm trying to splat as much as I can right now just because I like, I just like to, you know, I, you know, I have map control, if that makes sense, you know what I'm saying? Like, because like I said before, when I was third person commentating, map control is the name of the game. If you don't have map control, you can't win the game no matter how many kills you get. This ain't Call of Duty, my boy. This is all Splatoon. So you really have to like, I would say coordinate, but there's not really much coordinating in the game, but that's a flood that the game has. You can't really play with your friends because when you try to play with your friends, at least in casual from my understanding, they get thrown against you 100% of the time, which sucks. I'm chasing this guy. I'm trying to get that spot down real quick. Can I get it? Can I get it? Can I get it? Can I feed it to me, please? And I get a spot down. Thank you. I was looking kind of risky for my life. I'm not even going to lie with you. But, like I was saying, there is no true multiplayer in this game, so it's kind of hard to coordinate your attacks. You just got to kind of go off and do your own thing and just hope that you can sustain your team enough. And that's what I'm trying to do right here. I think I have enough solo powers, at least in this lobby, to go for the multi. I'm getting chased right here, man. This Amy girl, she's just been on me since game one. But, it's nothing I can do about it right now. Um, like I said in the first game, I'm having a lot of fun with Splatoon. I love the music. The game is extremely incredible. It looks great on my 4K TV. It plays super great. It's, it's a lot. Oh, come on, Fabian. It's not even fair, man. But it plays super great. The music is awesome. Like, I, I, I don't have any complaints about it. I just wish that Nintendo cared more about it, man. That whole thing was like shutting down. That whole thing was shutting down the Splatoon 2 North America tournament because people had free melee in their names. It was, it was a petty deal on on Nintendo's part, if I do this to myself, I I know that it's Nintendo's property and do what they want with it, but the way they handle the situation about like the members of Melee using Slippy and Dolphin and all that to keep the game alive, it's just kind of petty to me. Like, if you was a publisher of a game, wouldn't you want the older games to stay alive so you can bring attention to the series and find lots of get them to buy the newer games? But that's just my take on it, though. I get the spot down on Amy here because, you know, I'm, I'm petty when it comes to Amy. I was taunting the girl if you couldn't tell. I'm spamming Booyah in the chat. I'm not. You can't see that. I'm just saying that after recording. But I get the spot down over here because there's a lot of problems in it. I won't be able to cover that in enough time. So I'm trying to go as fast as possible right now. So I can just make sure that 100% of this area cleared out. Purple is really just been looking kind of sorry this game, but you know, I see a lot of like clothing options 
And Harry Styles is platooned too, but when I go to my character, like, I don't see anything. I don't know if I need to buy the DOC or not, which I don't have the DOC, but I'm probably going to plan on getting it very soon. But I need them hairstyles sauce now because I don't got the sauce. And Amy just spawn killed me. Amy just loves picking on me as you can see. But let me take this time and talk about my um, channel, Let's Go Marty here. So I stream on Twitch for those of you who don't know. Twitch.tv slash let's go marty. I'll leave it in, I'll leave a link in the description and I'll also put it at the end of the um in the outro. But I stream on Twitch and there's a lot of good games coming out. Monster Hunter Rise. I'm a huge fan of the Persona series, so I'm going to be playing Persona, Monster Hunter Rise, maybe that new Mario game, depending on how I feel. I'm going to play that over on Twitch. But I do a lot of my content on Twitch, and I'm trying to expand to YouTube, but it's going to take me some time because I'm just not the best with editing. This is the final game of the night, Turf Wars on Gooby Arena. Now, going back to our last conversation that I had before I cut to this game, I just, it just felt weird to me for for me to keep talking through an edit, like through a cut, so I just stopped talking altogether. I'm gonna pick that up back in the situation, but at first I wanna just focus on the game for right now. So I'm trying to keep splatting as much of the area as I can. Obviously, it's Splatoon. Um, let me go back to what we're talking about though. So yeah, I stream a lot on Switch, and I need to get more content out here on YouTube, so I'm gonna start playing like a lot more high profile games like Monster Hunter Drops and Persona. If you guys want to see a Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate series, like, like almost like a prelude to Monster Hunter Rise before it drops, let me know. I can do that too. I was thinking about it, but I just, I don't know, I get, I lose motivation, you know? But, we're fighting really hard right now for this battle. I, I get the spot on Andy. I'm getting shot by Pickle, but this is really hard to avoid. And I end up getting, I end up winning the duel against Gabe, but I lose immediately to, who was that? Late, late text or whatever. But it's about 50-50 right now. I'm gonna spot on my boy Tio because I know Tio holding it down in the paint like always. I'm trying to spot as much area as possible, but it's just hard to play against that paint roller, man. Like, what's the point of me running around in that painting if I if I'm stuck against a paint roller? So I'm just trying to hold it down, get rid of all this pink paint, make sure I'm just gonna run freely if they need to. I'm trying to build up. See, like, I'm really trying to build up energy for this um splat down here. The reason all these videos are from the same lobby is because they were putting up a fight in this lobby. Like, I really felt like Amy was my arch nemesis. Like, we were really going at it in these lobbies. But at the end of the day, you're not walking with the victory because I'm the main character at the end of the day. And he's a side character. But I'm pushing through to the spot right now. I'm going to try to get a spot on this area that's all pink over here. Just because we can take that over. Perfect. I got this area all to myself. There's nobody here to contest me, so I'm just going to... You know, grab these three points here, make sure that sponge is as slow as possible. Get the spot on top of the sponge while I'm here too, on that paint roller guy. That guy is dead enough to come here, my boy, my girl, whoever. Hey, whoever you want to be, I'm cool with it. My Anna. And we push into this lobby very, very easy. I see Macho's in trouble, so I push up on him. Get the double kill and click on Game and Fabian. I'm still in this area chilling. I'm getting attacked by a paint roller, but I'm not really worried about it too much. Because you know, I know I'm doing my game. So I'm gonna try. I'm keep. I'm just trying to get as much pink out as possible. And, and, and look at the, and look at this guy's paint roller paint brushes. I'm gonna get a spot on this guy and buries him. I'm gonna roll over here onto this paint roller and call this room a disgrace and keep it pushing. Like they can't take over this area. I already won the game basically. I'm just trying to buy time. This paint roller really thought it was. I keep saying roller. This paint brush really thought it was smart. Did a jump down and press me. Even I just spot him instantly. While I may be wonky with the mushroom controls, I still know what I'm doing. So I'm obviously going to do this kid dirty. I'm, all these kids are done dirty. We keep control of this blue square by some gift, and that's game. It's over. And you can look at the map and tell it was even a fair fight. 59.8 to 27.8. Ladies and gentlemen, that concludes the games. First place with 8. Eight of them, eight kills, and three splat downs. I am really just pushing. If you're still here, thank you for making this far in a video. It, it means a lot to me. It really does. Um, I want to keep trying to make this YouTube thing work. But I'm live on Twitch regularly. My name is Let's Go Marty on Twitch. And you can find me on Twitter at Let's Go Marty underscore. Follow me there to stay updated on everything that I do. I tweet a lot. I have Twitter fingers. But thank you. See you next time.